Welcome back to Outside the Huddle on CST. It would be just another gain of 10 yards for the home team without hearing his voice announce, first down Saints. I can't do it like Jerry Romig, no one can. And for over four decades from Tulane Stadium to the Superdome, he's been more than a public address announcer for the black and gold. Jerry Romig is the voice of the Saints. Josh Brown kicking off as we begin this afternoon's game. Courtney Roby returning from the two-yard line to the Saints 28-yard line. First down, Saints! How it got started, um, Saints, the third year of the Saints, uh, they had, uh, they needed a PA announcer. <laughs> and, you know, Vic Schwenk, I believe, was the man who called me and offered me the job. Somebody must have suggested me to him. Uh, and I was as surprised as anybody when he called. And he said, would you be interested in being our PA? And I said, T positively. I've been looking to be a part of this program since it started. Uh, and uh, that's how it began. <laughs> Drew Brees passing complete to David Thomas at the five, gain of four, Laurinaitis on the tackle. 42 years. Uh, well, I'm one game shy uh, of completing 42 years. One more game here. Touchdown. people I've seen a lot of bad football but those were the early years and lately I've seen a lot of good football I just felt that when we, I guess we were a couple of years into being in the Superdome and it just something just happened and said let's have some fun with first down and I and I I picked it up and it's worked. It's, uh, it's, it's really is a trademark. First down, first down, first down, and goal, change. Oh, and you can feel it, that if you've said the right thing at the right time, and, and, and you feel that maybe what you said uh, has engendered into them additional spirit about the game. I think that's what's so much fun, being a part of it. Literally being, being a part of the, of the atmosphere that we're creating, uh, and all, all within the uh, groundwork of, of being fair to the other team. We try to be as fair as possible, but um, that's, that's what I really like. Drew Brees passing complete. Brought down by number 57, Chris Chamberlain. Gain of six, Saints play a second and four. And I've got such great help. Brother Francis uh, uh, is my chief spotter, uh, and he's, he kind of watches out for me. Tackled by number 55, Laurinaitis. My son Jay, my oldest, sits right, right above me in a sense. He's, he, he manages the uh, down and distance board, and Mary Beth, my daughter, they both kind of keep an eye on what I say and when I say it. Jonathan Vilma, gain of three on the play. Rams play a second and seven from there. It's, to me, it's, 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 it's so much fun. It's, uh, every game, I just look forward to it with such great anticipation. And um, it, that, that has happened this way, well, <laughs> thank you, Lord. It, it, it's, it's been fun, it really has. From the entire Saints Nation, and for everyone in the TV business here in the Crescent City, we owe a measure of thanks and gratitude to Mr. Jerry Romig, a true black and gold icon. Keep calling those first downs, Jerry. 
Coming up, the Saints let the good times roll for the holidays when Outside the Huddle continues. This week's Huddle Headlines are brought to you by Calco Travel.